Hi, uh, my name is Kishan. Uh, I was previously working as a uh, doctor in the Ministry of Health Malaysia for close to eight years. Um, I recently left my position to pursue a career outside of clinical medicine. And honestly, it was not really an easy decision. Um, it took me a couple of years to make that decision. I thought about it a couple of years ago, almost went through it, but um, it, I was not ready to leave at that moment. Um, it was during COVID actually. And after about two to three years, uh, I was still sort of revisiting that option, uh, which made me sort of take this um, uh, leap into another industry. Um, I was researching about um, groups and uh, um, organizations in Malaysia, outside Malaysia, for doctors who have left uh, clinical medicine. I even went on YouTube and uh, I was looking at videos on how doctors felt after leaving clinical medicine and doing other things and um, there were positives and negatives and you know you sort of have to to, to gauge uh, where where you are on that on that uh, scale whether you actually really want to leave or is it more of an environment sort of thing and for me initially I actually wanted to be a specialist but after working in uh, clinical medicine for a bit, I was uh, seeing that that goal of mine was sort of uh, losing its value. So I was thinking of going to other things. And I came across uh, Medic Footprints Malaysia. And I was looking at some of the things they had done and how uh, they sort of give you like this platform on um, transitioning clinical doctors into other fields um, and also clinical fields which is a good thing it's not it's not a biased organization um, I then saw that they were having a, uh, a summit and I, I went for it last August in 2022 and um, it was kind of it was pretty nice seeing different uh, doctors do different things and being successful at it um, they were talking about the pharma industry, they're talking about GPs and uh, even uh, hospital management. And it sort of opened my uh, eyes a bit more to seeing what uh, what doctors can do. And it sort of um, made me feel like I was uh, a bit safer in the sense, because all this while you rarely, you very, very rarely meet doctors who actually go out and do other things and and be successful at it so it's kind of nice seeing that and seeing how they spoke and how they interacted it was, it was a very different sort of uh, group of people and uh, being there and networking with a couple of people from pharma um, hospital management and, and sorts um, helped me in a way uh, because a um, couple of months after that, uh, I went for an interview and I got a position at a pharmaceutical company. And I really think being at that summit uh, helped me a lot uh, with meeting the right people and and uh, talking to the right people. So um, I really do hope that Medic Footprints Malaysia um, have more sort of these summits um, to so to show clinicians um, that there are other things you can actually do apart from going the usual route of um, completing your housemanship, becoming a medical officer, and then specialist training, and then becoming a consultant. So there are other things that that people who feel like that's not the right uh, route for them. So uh, thank you again, Medic Footprints Malaysia. Uh, appreciate all the work that you are you're doing currently. Thank you.